Hello, it's Rob from Maxwell's Grass Cutting Services, based in the northeast of England. I hope everybody is well and having a great day. This video is my take on how to mow like a pro. Now, I don't say I'm the greatest at it in the world, and I'm sure there's going to be others who are far more experienced than me. But I earn a living from mowing lawns, and this is just my way of of how I do it regularly to try and get the best results possible for the customer. And whether you're a homeowner or whether you're in business or whether you're starting out in business, I hope this helps. The equipment I use, I need a lawnmower. This is the Still RM650V. It's a petrol rotary lawnmower. You don't need something as fancy as this. But what I would advise, no matter what lawnmower you use, make sure it's got a good sharp blade. Second piece of equipment is a strimmer. Uh, I use a petrol, strim, uh, petrol strimmer, a still. Um, but if you're a homeowner and you're using a electric one, that's fine too. And the third piece of equipment is uh, a blower. Um, I just find that that is the uh, piece of equipment which just finishes things off uh, really really nice by blowing the edges and just cleaning the, the area up to give it a tidy finish. So what's the process I use? Um, the first thing I do is I blow any debris into the lawn, leaves etc. Just going round on the paths and just blowing them all into the centre of the lawn. Um, granted if there's going to be lots of debris I wouldn't dream of putting it all on the lawn I would just sweep it up but sometimes I'm talking about just a few leaves like we can see in this garden here at the bottom of the garden, there's two small red robin shrubs and they always drop a few leaves throughout the season. So I blow them onto the centre of the lawn. I then go around and I mow the lawn. Uh, today I'm doing it uh, vertically uh, from where the camera is away, as you can see. I do altern alternate, so the next time I might go across the way from left to right. Uh, and that helps the uh, the lawn to look nice over the course of the season. Uh, once I've mowed it once, I then go around the circumference of the lawn in an anti-clockwise direction with the still petrol strimmer. And that uh, rotates in an anti-clockwise direction, so you put in any debris into the lawn. I then go around and blow all any waste or clippings. There isn't a great deal but it just gives it a bit of a fit, nice finish into the lawn. And then finally, I go over and do a second cut. Now, not all lawns, because some are just too big and it wouldn't be, uh, it just wouldn't be profitable. You, you'd be, financially, it's not, you know, if you spent an hour cutting the lawn, I understand you can't spend another hour giving it a second cut. But if it's a lawn like we've got today, which is approximately 120, 125 square meters well the second cut takes probably five to ten minutes and for me it's very similar to when you're decorating at home you know you, you put the emulsion on the wall and it looks okay but when you put that second coat on it it just gives it that super finish and, and, and that's what a, a second cut does for me and finally once I've given it the second cut again I go around with the leaf blower just to get any sort of excess clippings that I might have uh, dropped onto the surrounding paths and borders and just give them a blow just to make it look really neat and really tidy for the home when we're coming home. Um, and that's me, that, that, that's how I sort of do it operationally. But there's a little bit more to it than just having a process and a system in place. What's really important is the cutting height uh, many people have the blade too short and they take off more than a third. I would advise in the UK, don't cut under 2.5 inches, 70 millimeters. Try and keep that blade a little bit higher. That will help the grass um, and it will help you just produce a lovely lush lawn. Try and mow regularly, at least every seven days. I see so many people let the grass get to a foot tall and then take it, scalp it down to, where, to a, within an inch of its life and it goes yellow and it looks awful. So mow regularly, 
only take a third off. Use a good lawnmower with a nice sharp blade and you're halfway there. You really are. So if you've enjoyed the video, that's enough talk from me. Please like and subscribe. And this is my journey on how I run my gardening business in the northeast of England. And uh, I try and post regular content on the work I do, different lawns, the problems I've come up against, situations that I've had to go through to sort of deliver that quality service to the customer. And I hope you're enjoying it. So thank you. And I'll uh, let you enjoy the rest of the video. Take care now. And remember, when the green gold is growing, keep mowing. All the best now. Yeah, yeah.